59th annual Fight for Freedom Fund Dinner is underway right now at Cobo Center. 7 Action News reporter Julie Bonovich is live from there. Julie, I imagine the comments of L.A. Clippers owner Donald Sterling may come up once or twice during this evening. Right, and they sure did come up, Dave. And we'll show you what Reverend Wendell Anthony talked about before. Before the program began, but before we do that, we want to show you what's going on inside right now. So take a look. This is the largest sit-down dinner of its kind in the world. They started around five o'clock tonight. Charles Ogletree Jr. is the keynote speaker. He's a Harvard Law School professor that is well known. That's a well-known lawyer and civil rights educator. Now, two lifetime achievement awards are being handed out tonight to Congressman John Dingell and U.S. Senator Carl Levin. Other special guests include Hollywood co-host Sean Robinson. Now, before the dinner began, Reverend Wendell Anthony, the chapter president, talked about several things, including those racially charged comments by the L.A. Clippers owner Donald Sterling. And Sterling actually was supposed to be honored by the L.A. chapter for promoting civil rights. So Wendell Anthony saying we shouldn't focus on the negative comments, but the poli policies and institutions that allow these kinds of things to continue to happen. Individual comments don't bother us. It's institutional policy that prevents us from our forward movement. And so I think that we're very clear on that one. Uh, and we pray that our nation uses this as a teachable moment uh, to understand that we still have some rivers to cross. And they expect just about 10,000 people to be here tonight. So it's definitely going to be a great night. We're live from Detroit. Julie Bonovich, 7 Action News. It is impossible.